to get you a night here. They have great breakfast, an awesome patio, and we'll show you all that now. So we are up on the terrace for a hotel with our new friend. So this is where we've been lounging out the past couple days. We'll show you a little bit around here. There's a hot tub that you can rent out and then also a trampoline you can lay in and plenty of puppies to play with. So there's a great spot, an awesome place to have breakfast. They have a full spread with cheese, um, some like ham, you get eggs, french fries. We'll show you that spread now and then also show you the view in the morning of all the hot air balloons. so much fun staying at this cave hotel and would definitely recommend this ran us about $47 a night uh, this is just the outside terrace right outside our room uh, the staff was really great so here's the actual room I think we got a double because it was uh, significantly cheaper plenty of room in here for the both of us so you got a really neat facade so it's kind of keeping with the cave look at the cave hotel they have here um so you got the sink and then a huge shower here kind of almost like a rain shower and then also the shampoo and conditioner they provided was actually phenomenal it smells real good and the neat thing i think is like you kind of have impressions here that make it look different and rugged and i enjoyed that hair dryer which was a bless <laughs> The town we stayed in by our hotel was pretty small, um, sort of touristy. Uh, we had a great experience at a lot of the shops and local restaurants, and we had a chance to practice some of our Turkish. TV tour was so much fun and I would highly recommend it. There's a few options. You get horseback riding, ATV, also I think they had camelback, um, but I would just say the best bang for your buck is probably the ATV because you can see the most. Um, also they let you stop and um, take pictures and have tea and it's just, it, it's a really great experience. This was probably one of my favorite experiences from our entire trip to Turkey. Um, going into a hot air balloon, it's this amazing feeling. Um, you're kind of scared, but I will say I felt pretty safe and secure the whole time. And it was just such a beautiful way to see the country. How are you feeling, Gabby? <laughs> just it's, hit, not, it's not as scary as I thought. We just hit 500 meters. It's kind of scary. And we keep going up, so we will see how high we get. Whenever you, you go in the world after the safety, uh, safety balloon landing, we celebrate. It's very cool. One, two, three. Uh. <laughs> We are now walking into the Open Air Museum, which is a really popular tourist destination. They had an option where you could get a package and they have several different museums in the area um, that you can go check out, so just as an option. This museum shows a huge display of historical monasteries. You will also find several 11th century chapels in the caves. Thank you all so much for tuning in to our Cappadocia video. 
if you are looking to spend some time in Cappadocia for a few days, um, this is just a couple suggestions. <laughs> Brandon, my heart is broken. 